Okay, first game, what do we got? Blaze of Glory. Keep a stiff neck. Hey, Sophist, how you doing? Kick the volunteers for justice? Or I could just play them off the pyrotech. Yeah. I'll leave it in deck. This is my council target? I don't want to play this from hand, but I'm pretty happy to dunk a TA. Shouldn't have any volunteer anyway. So let's dunk a TA. Did I figure out the issue with matchmaking? It wasn't an issue with matchmaking. It was an issue with uh, names with capital letters not properly being represented in the back end if you logged in using your name in lowercase. Or something like that. It should be fixed, is the point. Guard still dead. Uh, there's an enslaved deck that's doing all right. Enslaved five. Blood for small blood. It was not an issue that I was expecting there to be, but yeah. Basically, I was assigning the username from the input rather than from the database. So whenever I did a lookup based on the username, it gave the wrong result. This is a really big Mahaka Marauder. So, the Square Tail deck? We're trying this. I don't know if like this is the list people had in mind. I just threw this together before the stream, but it seems fine. Um, can I kill the greatsword? No. We're the best regiment in the whole plowing north. Why aren't the inputs case sensitive? Because I don't want you to have to log in with the with all the capital letters properly capitalized in your username. Also, I don't want people to like register accounts that are like the same as someone else's, but with the capital letter instead of a lowercase letter. Yeah, like, the database stores the username with the capitalization you register with, and then an invariant, which is basically just the, the lowercase version. Logins are checked by the invariant, but it's set based on what you entered at the login screen. Very few things care about what you... Uh, what you, um... Uh, enter the username as, but the tournament mode was one of the few, and didn't end up breaking. So I basically just set it to read the username from the database rather than from input. Which it probably should have been the entire time. Uh, so what are we doing here? I want to play... I played Marauders. I don't have my Neuromancy. But that's fine. Got a hearty hankering for Gwent. Am I like out of things to do already? I can play the Pavco. I guess the Pavco is pretty bad in round three, but what am I doing after that? I don't want to play the Pact. Eh, maybe I can. Oh, this still gets skewered. Oh. Is the boat. Ugh. Gate scarf's fine. Um. Eat card round three. 
I've got Elzy, maybe it's fine. The Gigascorp's gone, so the Elzer might live to force him to use leader on the Figus. They fixed tourney mode yet? Uh, not for Gwent, no. Vlad was just on a podcast yesterday saying they still had bugs to fix. Palm can move the frigate. Elders, but I'm against Milfgrave decks that have a lot of locks. Uh, yeah, Elders is pretty bad against locks. That is true. Oh my god, no. No! No, deck! Why? Do I Nero for Defender? Unitless for a couple turns. I have to make a decision this next turn for what I want to do. Alls are allowed to retreat from your leader faction. Would that be better? Uh, it's like a significant buff to the card. If only because it's removing Regis from the Aniromancy pool. So if I Forest Protector, I'm committing to not getting the Defender. I, I hate this. I hate this so much. Now I've like committed anyway. This is just gonna die to leader. You think me Any monsters elves are better than other factions? Yeah, they'd be the only faction with the spear tip and pool. That said, I think there's plenty of factions you can like deterministically make it to seven, right? Off of Neuromancy, and that's not bad. Yeah, it's what Draug and spear tip for monsters. Or Drag's not a monster's card. Wait, is it just Spirit Tip? It is just Spirit Tip, isn't it? Hmm. Oh, Kaltala, right here. Right. <laughs> wow, so the two high rolls. Is there any reason to use this? It's just getting blazed. Like technically a monster. Draug used to be a monster card. A long time ago. Just think about how he wants to kill it. What is the effect? Uh, you banish all cards from both graveyards and then spawn one power tokens on each player's board equal to the number of tokens that were banished, or units that were banished. Did he just not kill Alzer? Holy shit. Are we winning now? Um... Still there with one power units? It was that at some point, too. It's done a couple things. I don't have the pact in here. I just want the forest protector. Some forest protector. Um, forge here so that he can't just use Blood Eagle on it. Using him to defend it. This is just more points than the defender. 
Even if he kills the Elzer with leader, it's sort of fine. Is there a 5 in there? He does. So he's still lining up the Blood Eagle. If he doesn't click the Raider, I can take Rock Slide instead of Pact. Oh, what? Okay. No respect. Blood Eagle's in the graveyard. Oh. Oh. <laughs> when did that happen? <laughs> Does this get skewered? If I packed it, it doesn't? Imagine not respecting Elzy. Uh, six. Yep. Sounds right. Twenty-three point Elzy. Slightly above average. Okay, chat. I think we're winning. Imperial formation. Alzer friend. I am not crazy enough to not respect Alzer. <laughs> this is one of my fewer battle decks. <laughs> be in this deck. Oh, maybe it is full mages. I didn't meme that hard. Rock slide for pyrotech. Good trade, good trade. Yes, that would fit perfectly. I think it's a lot of people on mobile and a lot of people that just don't, don't care. Battle theme? Probably. Uh, oh, I don't have it by the name. Yeah, Chrono Cross. Gale. You can see the song on the top of the screen, though. It doesn't say what game it's from. I just have the composer. Man! All these Alzers that just don't quite get ahead. like my viewer battle deck. I'm 
I expect this to be pretty bad, maybe? I don't really have a ton left. Heatwave answers a defender. Trades down with the defender, but answers the defender. <sighs> I don't know. Kinda shitty. You too many golds in hand for us. We'll get that fixed in no time, I promise. You get the predicted no badge. Uh I think if you do you have to win the prediction or do you just have to predict? I don't actually know. Force his last card out. Try to trade leaders too. Oh wait, this is a five. Oh god, and the boost this thing. Okay. I guess we're not. I should just take the thunder. Whoops. So, I've still got Gord. Hopefully. Maybe. Okay. I mean, you could still lose those to Elzer and Aeromancy. There it is. But he put it melee, so he loses now. Hooray! Hello? Hmm. Let's just rebuke here. No reason to click on this right now. He could still win here. Especially if he has a pawn in this deck. Yeah, you probably don't want to put your Elzer melee if you play a Neuromancy. Pretty much any bubble thingy? What bubble thingy? Ah. 
Can we beat this Nilfgaard chat? Round for very long. Temper there. Did my depress thirty seconds early? I don't know. It should be lasting a minute every time. But it might desync for whatever reason. Must be the most competitive deck we played, Alzir Eyes. Uh, probably. Probably. Not beating this Helga. Ridiculous to know what decks are playing Heatwave and a Nero while climbing on ladder. Player on now. Uh, yeah, just about every non devotion deck is playing Heatwave. Probably something you should respect, unless you have reason to think your opponent's devotion. That's been the case for a while. Awkward. There's counsel for Dunka, right? Prob for Alzi. They could do that. I'd rather see them just like buff old spear tip and buff Regis. Just make the rolls a little less extreme. It's not like those cards have to be at their current provision costs. Making Alzer a 7 for 12 is a buff. Pretty significant buff, too. Let him create my rock slide. The senses can be Darn. Easy. 
Get a marauder now. Next time it'll be personal. Oh, oh let's get some good informant. Yeah, that's bad. I should do this much later. Much, much later. That was really bad. Got one assimilate unit that sticks. That's fine. <laughs> Leave it to us. I do want to play a Nero next to not give him in a Nero with leader guaranteed. I don't care too much if he gets rock slide. He might just be leadering me now. Nope. My powers are yours. Come on. Hey, Ryan. Thanks for your gift in the tier 2 to Peepo Netflix. Welcome, welcome. So, Force Protector is 11, 12, 13. I feel like this is probably similarly good. Rock slide. A gourd. Yeah, this gourd's the same as rock slide. I might need to deal more damage to something. Pretty sure this rock slide's going on the gourd, though. Ow. What is his deck? I guess we're losing. How big is the gourd? 15. Maybe we're fine. He doesn't have an answer to the cord. I guess we're fine. Wash this blood from my hands. Maybe not. <laughs> yep, the Adadels are into the game without an expansion. He needs nine. That's pretty easy. But he is Nilfgaard, so who knows? that more often. Yeah, I can see it. Hey, swan song. That does work. <laughs> that does work. Oh god, what if we just lose to? Did not win. I know I saw the one, the bomb thingy. Keep a stiff neck. Take a Mahawk mail. Ugh. I don't know. And you just get like invoed harder if you haven't already baited the invo. Just the bomb. 
section. Christ. Okay. Ah. So needy. People play or any joust. Ow. At least my character went on the right thing. <laughs> Bleeding. Okay, I I'll need to read the card. I didn't really read it. Nope, that's the actual name of the card. GDPR's naming has never been the best. Not that that's particularly an example of awful naming, but nothing surprises me. <laughs> Smoke them out as a sign of things to come, yeah. <laughs> At least we haven't gotten any arbalists in a while. Getting his full blue boy. So he is lippy. Next time it'll be personal. Hi ho, hi ho. Just a clear design philosophy. Every name was a noun. Yeah. Hey, er, Kamiya. Thanks for the tier one. Thanks for the two months. Welcome, welcome. Okay, what are we doing here? Do I even want to be pushing? Pushing Lippy sounds like a disaster, but so does getting Saris in round two. At least I'll be able to go, like, Defender Alzer. Gord ever beat the push. I feel sort of fucked here, not gonna lie. I did lose that last game. You know, they're saying the card abbreviates twat. They probably do. So Delirium, Gigascorp are gone. Can I just jam Alzer? I'm just gonna jam Alzer. No fear. Is the bomb a score? It's okay. I didn't know that. Oh no. Oh, I thought it was neutral like all the other bombs. As I said, I didn't really read it very closely. That's weird. We shall do it my way. Let's not get in the way of the axe. The tempo. Nigh. 
Don't you pester me. At least he's playing into the Pavco. With like some low tempo plays. This helps us a bit. Now I'm in range with the protector. Got the stunning blow. I'm in range to take with Heat Wave on the Ceres. So, I mean, that's pretty good. He cut the roach, I guess. It's just no roach. It's gonna be Nicker's Morkvarg. Assuming there's a Morkvarg. He's got last play, though, and I can never beat last play. I guess I had the leader. Uh, if I leader, then I can't get with the Ceres and I lose anyway. Yeah. Eh. Might just be a lose lose. Maybe he won't find Curse of Corruption. And by won't find Curse of Corruption, I mean has to play a Neuromancy and doesn't have another tutor. No? I mean, it depends what you think of as too many removal options. There's like sort of an argument that ever since Homecoming the games had better removal than there are threats. That's necessarily a new thing. Like it's only pretty recently that we've had the like put heat wave in our deck to deal with threats. Usually the efficient removal is just so much better. Flippy. Just because you find it annoying doesn't mean that other people don't find it fun. It's uh, mostly due to things like a uh, like Kelly shield wall symbiosis. It's just nice to have this catch-all answer when your opponent sometimes. That one probably doesn't answer like a shield advice agoda. And there are plenty of decks that, like just don't want to play Curse of Corruption and too many matchups where it's just bad. The nice thing about Heat Wave is it's never terrible. Vincent? Uh. Yeah, sorta. Being a faction card, though, and only being relevant one sixth of the time because of that. There's nothing wrong with playing Lippy decks. What the fuck? Imagine being upset at your opponent playing a mediocre deck. If they just find fun.
I did watch a bunch of the Summit series, yeah. Uh, Manga went on a tear. <laughs> what a monster. Oh, I can... Sure, we can. Excuse me, Mango Finals, yeah. Hungry Box is a... Looks back in form to you. It's the drama between Melee Tournament and Nintendo. Uh, just a bunch of people are never going to consider buying a Nintendo game ever again. No biggie. I got Geralted. Sad. No! What? Come on! <laughs> That's a tilt and a half. I guess it's gonna take some more passion. Okay, well that that's better. That's better. Never happens. Well, in my case, it's pretty easy. It's the only Nintendo game that I care about at all is Melee, so... I... I meant to click whatever. It's fine. It doesn't matter. Controversy anyway. A uh, Nintendo C&D a Melee tournament. that mean? Uh, the big house isn't running Melee or Ultimate this year. Super fucked. Super duper fucked. Right, and we're gonna, he took one damage and inflicted zero. Yeah, but keep in mind that I could have clicked it and dealt damage to his board. Are they issue a C&D? Uh, because Nintendo hates Melee. <laughs> Nothing we didn't already know. Just, uh... It seemed like Nintendo was finally going to be hands-off. After, you know, like, trying to kill Melee multiple times in the... the 2010s. But nope. So, leader, rock slide is short. Oh, yeah, click with your rock slide click. click. That would have been fine. That said, he might just, uh. Might just hit us with the old 2 0. Squirrel our endearmancy, make our life miserable. Okay, okay. I respect it.
still has Manticore. Does he still have leader charges? Why can't I check if he has leader charges? Just one leader charge. That's a very convenient number of leader charges. I'm not gonna lie, I have no idea why people are upset with CPR right now. I thought, like, game delays were par for the course. Twitch throttles ad block. Uh. Hey, jokes. Thanks for the prime gaming. Thanks for the three months. Welcome back. Sure, I mean, that seems like a more reasonable thing to be upset about, I guess. I don't know. I look at the, uh... <laughs> the struggles melee player go players go through with Nintendo. <laughs> and all the complaints about CDPR just seem so meaningless. Hashtag free melee. Hashtag fuck Nintendo. 